I'm gonna walk you through how Proteus testing is done and how to interpret your results once you get them. So first, you're gonna come into performance testing mode. Once you get in here, you'll see a variety of tests. You have our own ecosystem tests, as well as when you create your own test, they will appear down here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk through one of our more popular tests which is the Proteus General Power Test. The Proteus General Power Test is about a three to five minute test. It features seven moves, it's full body. And in those three to five minutes, you'll get a full report that will show you where your athlete falls on the force velocity curve and give you some recommendations on how they can train to improve. For a first time athlete, we recommend doing a practice set to eliminate bias. So after you complete your test, you'll come here to the results screen. What you're gonna to wanna to do right when you get into this results screen is to check your filters. This is important because Proteus compares you to our massive cloud database of everybody who has taken this test. So you wanna get as granular as possible into the actual filters. So you can filter by, by gender, age, weight, height, side dominance, sport, even position and skill level. Again, you'll wanna get as granular as possible because the more specific you are, the more specific your results will be and your recommendations will be to you. Here's an example test from somebody else, but what you'll see immediately, if you've done a test before, you'll see trend lines that show your results from the past and how you're comparing now. You'll also see an overview on your power, your acceleration, your Proteus score, and your general power balance. Once you've set your filters, now the place you really wanna go is our insights tab. In this tab, the first visual you're gonna see is our fan visual. And this is a very quick overview of exactly how your athlete stacks up against their cohort and on the force velocity spectrum. You come in here, you'll see the different movement categories and your athlete will have different ones placed out here dependent on how they perform. So we have low strength, speed dominant, strength dominant, and high strength and speed. This specific athlete is very strength dominant with just their, their pole movements being high strength and speed. So this is an immediate indicator that they need to train speed to kind of balance this out and try to push all of this into the green. The goal here is to move everything from the left all the way to the right. We call it moving into the green. As you scroll down, you'll get an even more granular look into each movement category, and you'll see these dials. The outer dial represents your power. The inner dial represents your acceleration. So your main goal here is one, to fill these dials up. That means you're increasing your numbers in both power and acceleration overall, but you also wanna close the gap between these two numbers. And that's where you see things in the green, the gap between the power score and the acceleration scores within five percentile points of each other. As you scroll down, this is where you get your actual recommendations. So dependent on how you tested and what categories you fell into, you'll see hyper-personalized results for that section. So this athlete was very strength dominant, so we're gonna see a lot of movements here on the right that gives them ways to train acceleration. So for their elbow flexion, it's recommending training band-resisted bicep curls, band-resisted chin-ups, things like that. Once you open these up, you can also get more information here at the top, you'll get a signal if there's an imbalance from left to right, or if they say they have low elasticity, that will also show up here. One of the best parts once you get through all these results is you can actually share to your athlete's mobile device. All you have to do is go in here, you can either add their email or they can scan this QR code. It'll send a push notification right to their mobile device and they'll be able to open it up. Our clients use this to sell assessments, upcharge assessments, or provide customized and personalized training recommendations for their clients. We've also seen them come in and do camp models or use it to bring more athletes in their door that they might not train on a day-to-day -day basis. This is all because you can do tests within three to five minutes. It's super quick, it's super easy, and the results you get are very actionable. We can't wait to see what you guys do with your Proteus.